So Jace asks who made the grenade and Vi just names Jinx. She just straight up betrays her sister. What's going on here? Here's my theory. At this point, Vi has Silco as the real problem. He brainwashed Powder. He corrupted her. She takes him out. She can break his spell and Powder will just resurface. Vi's coming here to beg for Piltover's help. They're the only ones who are strong enough to help her take on Silco. Okay, now remember what Vi said to Caitlyn? You expect everyone to give you what you want. You have to let them think you have what they want. If she wants something from Piltover, she has to offer up something she has that they want. That's the rule. And she only has one thing to offer. Now, Kate doesn't actually work in a brothel and Vi won't actually let them have her sister. But the way things work in the Undercity is you give a little and they give a little. The council wants one thing they want to name. Vi gives it to them thinking they'll reciprocate as they should. Actually handing Jinx over? No, that would be another negotiation, the next deal. And Vi has no plans to make that deal. But right now, by the only rules Vi knows, she has to offer something to get something, so she does. And then the council scams her. They take what she gives them and they don't give anything back. They refuse to help her at all. Classic Piltover, and that's partly why she gets so mad. And why she completely loses faith in Piltover as a whole as a result of the scene. She came in there believing they might be capable of decency, but they broke the only set of rules she knows.